I have a friend who trains hunting dogs, and he takes them out into the, you know, by the lakes and stuff, and he teaches them to run into the water and come back and, and retrieve ducks and stuff, which is really cool. And my friend said to me one day, he said, hey, I wouldn't have a dog that didn't earn his own keep. And I got to thinking about that, and I thought that was a really good idea. I didn't want to have a dog either that didn't earn his own keep, and so that became important to me. So what I did, since I don't hunt, I do like to read the newspaper, but there's a lot of stuff in the newspaper I really don't care about. So what I did is I taught my dog to read the newspaper, go through, pick out the stuff that he thought I would find interesting, put a little mark by it, and then take a little sticky note and write on there, you know, kind of a summary of what the article was about. He put the sticky on there, and then I could just go through, look at the sticky, decide if I want to read the article or not. Saved me a whole lot of time. It was really, really cool. And so one day, you know, I was coming home, and I come in the house, and there's my dog, and the dog is peeing on the carpet. And the first thing that was handy is, you know, there's this newspaper, and so I grab the newspaper, I whack the dog, and I say, bad dog, bad dog, you know, don't be peeing on the, news, on the, on the carpet here. And from that day on, you know, that dog would not read the newspaper. If it wasn't for the fact that that dog was good with numbers and could run a financial spreadsheet, that dog would have been history.